Hey guys, welcome back to a new workout. We are going to be doing a full body express workout. Super easy to do anywhere. The only thing you will need is some small ankle weights. So let's get started. Place your feet hip wide apart, roll those shoulders back. Place those elbows onto the sides and reach out slowly in and out. You can move a little, just like warming up those arms, warming up that upper body and really reaching to the other side of the room. Reach your arms long. Throughout this exercise or throughout the workout, we are working at sculpting, lengthening and strengthening all those muscles. So pull those abdominals in here. Shoulders are wide. There we go, it's warming up. Really squeeze those arms whenever you're out and in. If you don't have little arm weights, you can also Use anything you find in the house, like water bottles or cans. For five, four, three, two, one. Reach the arms out and move them in and out. So palms go up and down. You really squeeze those abdominals. Chest is wide open. Doing this for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two and one. Reach the arms up and down, up and down. So the palms go towards each other, down through the floor, towards each other, down through the floor. It's almost like you're really pressing air or water towards the ground. <sighs> I know, I feel this burn already <laughs> for five, four, three, two and one. Palms are up. Arms come in and lengthen out. Really feel that extension, working those biceps, working those triceps. There we go for 10, nine. We're doing this a little bit of tempo today because the workout is a little bit shorter. Seven, six, five, keep breathing. Four, three, two, and one. Arms are out, 10 little circles forward, 10. Nine, eight, feel that burn, we're almost there. Four, three, two, and one, and reverse right here. Little circles backwards. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. So arms down, shake it out a little. Now bend the knees. Upper body comes a little forward. Bend the arms 90 degree angles. Shoulders are nice, wide and open. I want you to really squeeze those shoulder blades together. I want you to extend, squeeze and hold. Come back to a 90 degree. Extend, squeeze those triceps, squeeze those shoulder blades and look. Your eyes are right in front of you. 10, nine, keep breathing, eight, Seven, six, five. Squeeze those glutes. We're standing here. Two, three, two, and one. Hold here. Ten little pulses up for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Arms come down, shake it out. I want you to place them in front of the mat. We are going to use them in a second. Now walk to the back of the mat, feet hip wide apart, roll the shoulders back. Bend the knees, reach the arms up to the sky. Now pull those abdominals in and slowly roll over like you're rolling over an imaginary ball. Arms come to the ground and walk in front to a plank position. Now hold, lengthen through the spine. The hips are nice and leveled out. Eyes are in front of you and hold for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now bring your left knee towards your right elbow, place it back and other side. So here you go, one, cross, and two, arm tap, arm tap. 
So knee comes towards the elbow, other knee comes to the elbow, and tap, tap. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow, tap, tap. Really keep that spine straight and don't put your hips far up or down. Keep them in the middle, lengthen through that spine. For four, three, couple more, working those abdominals, really squeeze everything in that body. Two, one more. And come back to plank position. Bring your elbows to the ground and hold in a plank position. Squeeze those glutes, lengthen through the spine, eyes are in front of you and hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Slowly come to your knees. Come to into a deep child pose. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Let everything go. One more inhale. And exhale through the mouth. Now slowly roll up to your all fours. I want you to grab a little weight. If you have ankle weight, you can put them on your ankle. If you have a little hand weight, put them right behind your knee. Now I want you to really squeeze that heel to the butt. So you're holding that weight and you're not dropping it. That's the challenge here. So come into an all four, spine is straight. Extend that spine, eyes are in front of you. Take a deep inhale through the nose. Engage those abdominals. On the exhale, we're slowly lifting that leg into a donkey kick and slowly coming back down. So up and down, squeeze through that glute. If your weight is dropping down, you're not squeezing hard enough. I know it's a challenge here. Four, six, five, slow and controlled. Four, three, two, and one. Hold up here, 10 little pulses. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly come back down. Left elbow comes to the ground, the right stays up. Keep the right heel squeezed to your butt. Open up to the side into a clam and slowly come back down, working those outer glutes. Squeeze, hold, and slowly come back down. So we're going up, hold, slowly come back down. Roll those shoulders down, relax the neck, engage that core for eight, seven, working those glutes, six, five, keep breathing, four, three, two, and one. Hold up here, ten so rolls forward, ten, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ten circles backwards. Reverse for ten. Nine, it's a tiny little motion, almost like an orange or grapefruit size. Nothing big. Four, five, four, three, two, and one. And slowly come back to the middle, to your all fours. I'm going to switch sides because I have a wall behind me. You at home can stay. Place the weight behind your left knee. Come to all fours. Always start in a well-balanced and a good posture beginning. So lengthen through that spine. Roll those shoulders back. Eyes are in front of you. Really squeeze that knee towards your butt and come into a donkey kick. Squeeze that glute and slowly come back down. Up and squeeze and down for 10. This motion is slow and controlled. Keep the neck relaxed. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, 
two, and one. Hold up here, 10 little pulses. Squeeze that glute like you're pressing to the ceiling for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Great job, we're almost there. Four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring the knee down, bring the right elbow to the ground. Now I want you to really engage that core and squeeze that glute. Open up that leg into a clam and come back to the middle. Open, hold, and down. This squeeze on top is really important because you're really working that outer glute muscle here. Eight, seven, shoulders are relaxed. Engage that core. Five, four, keep breathing. Three, we're almost there. Only circles after. One, down, and hold up here. 10 little circles forward, 10, nine, eight, seven. These circles are very tiny. Three, two, one, and reverse backwards for 10. Nine, last exercise on this side, push through. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come back to the middle, place the weight onto the side, and come quickly into a deep child's pose. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. Let all the tension go in your body. Maybe you want to wiggle a little from left to right. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. And slowly come back up. We're coming onto our back, into our final ab series, always our favorite. Grab your little weights. Bring your legs into a tabletop position, 90 degree angle and reach those arms up to the sky. Take a deep inhale through the nose. The shoulders are pressing to the ground. They're not like up here. Take a deep inhale through the nose. On the exhale, reach that left leg and the right arm long backwards and come back in. We're staying on the same side for 10. So really feel that extension in that whole body. Squeeze that leg left. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come back to the middle, coming into the other side. So extend that right leg and the left arm long. So opposite sides and come back to the middle for 10. Working those lower abdominals here, really squeeze. Eight, seven, we're almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Come back to the middle, reach the arms up. Take a deep inhale through the nose. On the exhale, lift your head, neck and shoulders slowly off the ground and come to a little hover position. The, bees are, the, knees are, the, bees, <laughs> the knees are bent. You can also extend them or just hold them here. Now, I want you to do little circles with your arms. Your palms are facing towards each other. Little circuits in for 10, nine, Eight, find your balance here. I know this is really challenging. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Reverse for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold here, extend the leg long and in for 10, really squeeze and come back to that boat position. Seven, six, five, strong arms. Four, three, two, and one. 
Slowly bring the knees down, come to a seated position. Reach the arms in front of you, palms are towards each other. Inhale through the nose. On the exhale, slowly come halfway through. I want you to open the left side, open the right side 10 times. Nine, eight. The chest is nice, wide and open and really engage that core right here. Seven, the eyes follow whenever the arm is opening up. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold here, bend the arms and slowly come into the Russian twist right here from side to side. If you want a little more challenging, you can also lift those legs up. Otherwise, stay here, open up that chest, slowly move from left to right. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly come to your back, lose the, the weight, place your hands behind your neck, legs come into a tabletop. Inhale through the nose. On the exhale, coming in little sit-ups up and down for 10, nine, eight. Really squeeze, seven. We're on the final exercises here. Four, three, two, and one. Hold up here, extend the right leg long. That upper body twists, so the right elbow is reaching towards your left knee. We're holding for five, four, three, two, one. Switch to the upper side. Your left leg extends, your left elbow reaches your right knee. And that left leg is hovering above the ground and really squeeze, squeeze those abdominals, working that side oblique right here for four, three, two, and one. Now switch a little faster into a bicycle. So last exercise here. We can do it for 10, nine. After this, you guys are done with this express workout. So proud of you, but we're almost there. Five, four, really rotate that full upper body. Three, two, and one. Come back to the middle, slowly, Place the head, neck and shoulders off to the ground. Place your arms and feet on the ground. Move over to one side of your body. Press yourself up and you guys are all done for today. Thank you so much for joining this express full body workout. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below. All your support is so, so, so appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.